amazing. Now we're going to do the uh, snap election is what they're calling it. Chuck the Trudeau call it. I got something very important to say. And feel free to share this, Jay, because this is the truth of the matter. Uh, back in uh, November 2019, there was a memo that came across to, to the PM's office from the military intelligence agency that there was a virus in China. This is 2019, November. Okay, February, January and February 2020, which is only a few months away, they gave away all our PPE and all kinds of shit to China to try and get this virus under control, leaving the Canadians vulnerable. Okay, it was wrong, 100%. We went without this so-called virus was being spread around Canada. Okay, he ignored the memo from the uh, military intelligence intelligence agency, okay, and that's the high command, and it was wrong for what he did, and as it progressed anyways, we get into 2021, he finally stopped air traffic from China and India and all these places with the, the, the so-called variant, well, the shit was already here, he could have did that right off the hop. Now, I'm not embarrassed, but I was a paying member of of this party, you can see my name on the card called Liberal Party of Canada. Now, I played the game, I got vaccinated twice already, okay, and now they're saying booster shots and masks and fucking whatever, right, diapers on your head, okay, it's getting out of control. They're starting to close shit down again, and see this card right here? I paid the Liberal Party, and I was paying for years. There was good liberals, don't get me wrong. The Honorable Herb Gray, Curdy, was a great liberal, okay. But that, the time's long gone for the Liberals, okay? Justin Trudeau has done nothing but lie to the people of Canada. Okay, he was caught in numerous scandals, uh, the SNLC Lavalin scandal, okay, uh, where Jody Rape and uh, Ray Bull, who was the, uh, the, uh, the uh, justice minister at the time, he wanted her to do something which was illegal, and she wouldn't do it. Now, she left the party while she was kicked out. Jane Pisspot, another one that he had, Okay, and he talks about uh, treating women good, this and that. He don't, okay? He don't. He talks out uh, the side of his face, okay? And uh, I'm very disgusted. Anybody that does vote for liberal, even if you vote for the NDP, it's a, it's a vote for the uh, for the liberal. You can vote any way you want, but I'm just telling you the way that it is. You see this card here? Bought and paid for. And I've been vaccinated, so when Justin Trudeau says, oh, all these people that are protesting that are anti-vaxxers, this and that, uh, the ones that are booing them are anti-vaxxers. I'm fucking vaccinated there, Justin Trudeau. And you see this membership card? Okay. This card right here. You can shove this up your liberal asshole, okay, because I'm no longer with this party and what they stand for. They made a good card. It don't want to break. There's a piece. There's a piece, there's a piece. It's no longer liberal. One thing that is certain, I've been working a lot of hours uh, since the pandemic, a lot of hours. I've worked seven days a week. They say I'm essential, whatever. I'm happy with the situation, the way things are in that manner. But I'm not happy with the way that the prices of houses have, uh, have gone up. Like, I own my own house, so yeah, I mean, I'd be pretty ludicrous for me to say, oh, man, if now my house is worth six, seven hundred thousand dollars. I'm not, I'm very happy in that manner. So I'm not, I'm not happy in the manner of the people that don't own houses that will never get to own a house now. Like, uh, it'll be tough for my kids, so my kids will probably end up getting my house when I die. Whatever. So be it, right? They'll have a house. Um, but the price of rent, okay, and he's letting in immigrants from everywhere now, okay, there's nowhere to live. Now, the, the student uh, exchange or whatever uh, students come across from India and everywhere else in the world come to Canada, there's nowhere for these people to live. If you can't support your own Canadians, okay, and, and make things livable at a cost efficiency, you're the wrong guy for the job. And this has all happened on his watch. He's had six years to turn this shit around. And he hasn't done any of it, okay? Minus uh, in 
extravagant vacations to the Abbey Con in uh, you know, on the little island outside of uh, the, in the Caribbean. Okay, he's done all kinds of shit that way for himself, and they think for themselves. So with all that being said, I'm done with the Liberal Party. Spread this. This is the truth, okay? And I'm not, you know, speaking from a script. I'm speaking off the tip of my tongue, okay? They're dirt balls. Don't allow it. September 20th, I got one thing to say to the Prime Minister. Pack your shit and get the fuck out of fucking 26 Sussex Hall. Your days are numbered. Ciao for now.